Hello, you beautiful people. Today we're gonna see Charlie Kirk remind pro trans leftist men and women are different. Okay, let's just dive right into it and see what happens. Actually, we know what happens, so <laughs> yeah, let's just see it. That man has been an inspiring figure to me, and I call him a man because he's a transgender woman. Okay. You know, under your definition. So yeah. does that make him less of a man? Does the character he's displayed not only as a teacher, but as a veteran, well, look, that's does awfully, that reduce that's, his masculinity? That's awfully hypothetical because I don't know this person, but you're kind of proving my point. You said that the trans person is really empathetic, therefore feminine. Not really, no. There's yeah. no correlation there. Empathetic is Empathy a feminine Empathy is not quality. a feminine trait. No. It absolutely is. Absolutely not. You no. get a group of men together. No, no, no. There is no difference. <laughs> You there don't know exactly. No, the football team empathy, is not Karen. Empathy is one of the most masculine traits imaginable. Okay, look, I that's mean, what brings look, about man, change. Uh, all right, okay, so um, really? you're wrong. So yeah. how am um, I wrong? Because you're pandering to a specific crowd. Well, all of a sudden, my point. Dude, no, you are wrong. What the hell? Is invalid? Look again. You're playing the machismo, uh, machismo card. I'm machismo, not. Machismo, yes. Yeah. Because so you're the one who's placed such a value on the role of men. You you're the one. Let, let me finish the point. Yeah, Go ahead, slow down. Please. You're at like a 10. You've got to be at like a 3, man. All right? Okay, There's on. one person getting upset here. Here, you've got a bunch of men together, a hunting club, a football club, any sort of group of men. They're not sharing feelings, and they're not talking about like deep sort of thing. You know, you get women together, what do they do? Book club? Right? Not exactly like hunting and fishing. There's reasons for this. God designed us differently. You don't have to overthink it. Now, can certain men be more feminine than others? Of course. Can certain yeah. men have more of kind of an inclination towards empathy? Obviously. Do men have zero empathy? No. But there's a hard wiring. There's a circuitry. There's a DNA in us. And the Bible speaks to this. Experience speaks to this. And quite honestly, just look around. It speaks to you. There's different needs, wants, and interests all around you. So you ask a hypothetical question, but does it make the person less of a man, even though they, I, I, I'm not going to answer the hypothetical, but I will say this. The rejection of the patently obvious masculine and feminine traits that have built all of society and the humility it takes to say, I don't have patience as a man like women do. Guess what? Every man should have the courage to say that. I don't. I lose patience easily. I look at women, they have the patience to listen and all of this. I'm not, it's not the way I'm wired. I want to I I go through walls. I want to take care of problems. Guess what? That's masculine energy. If it's not properly harnessed, you could invade Ukraine. Like, that's basically what ends up happening, right? That, and we see that on full display. So thank you for your question. I'm going to get to other questions here tonight. So thank you. Appreciate it. Okay. Okay. That was a stupid argument. That was a stupid, stupid, stupid argument from that boy. Oh, my God. He doesn't know what he's talking about. Oh, my God. He doesn't know what he's talking about. Okay. So he thinks because that woman who turned into a man and the that basically that wired in her like she like every woman if you if you if you know them every woman it got this kind of like sense like oh i'm going to listen i'm going to i'm going to like let your feelings out and this is this is how they are wired you know not men women so if she turns into a man it doesn't mean that all men like her you know, and even if like okay, I'm not I'm not bashing out like what she did like to affect your life, all right? Maybe he changed, <clears throat> maybe she changed your life because she is a she, even if she trans. I don't know why if she's if she, even if she trans if she even if she transformed, you know? No, 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 you know. Uh, but it doesn't mean like oh every man like, like dude, it's the most. <clears throat> obvious answer if you if you are around men at all they don't share share feelings like in a very 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 uh, rare way like if, if my, me and my my friend if if <clears throat> if there is some very very big argument you know dude you laugh uh, with each other you know but if it goes like like dude like okay uh, with all seriousness they they get down and okay they go they get a deep conversation but I think it is once uh, or twice in a year that's that's what you get with men but women they want it every single hour of the day man and yeah that's I'm not saying that those is better than this no 
but this is how men wired and this is how women wire so <clears throat> where is where is your your debate where is your point you are not on point on that like just please please get like search before you speak please you know this is this is this is wrong and it's like this is like absolutely wrong when i've when i first heard it like oh she jesus come on Dude, you're not around men a lot, and and never like you 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 weren't around men in your entire life. No, men don't share feelings when they are with each other, and especially if they are with the, with a the large group. If any, at least, uh, and if do you want the, 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 the actual truth? If someone shared his feeling, the other ones they they they're gonna. They're gonna laugh at him, you know. They're gonna do me. They're gonna make jokes like, "Oh, it is it's under the touchy, touchy and uh, feely, feely," you know. So uh, yeah, that was a stupid question. Anyway, guys, this was the video for today. Hopefully, you enjoyed it. If you did, subscribe, and I'm gonna see you in the next video. Bye bye.